Okay guys, what's up? So this is going to be a tutorial on how to do double UFO lunar flips. This is what the trick looks like. Okay guys, so that was a trick. I'm gonna tell you right now, this trick is hard. This trick is only for advanced players. Make sure you have a background in inward lunars, UFOs, and a lot of combos. You, yeah, this is an advanced trick, so don't, beginners do not try this. Or yeah, you can try it, but okay. So what you wanna do for this trick, you're gonna pull up to inward lunar, okay. So, I feel like when people have trouble with this trick, it's getting it to stay straight, like the actual momentum to get it to fly in the air like a UFO. And yeah, I also feel like that's the hardest part. And catching it also, everything's the hardest part. This trick is just hard. So you're gonna get it into inward lunar and uh, you're gonna like go towards your right side first to gain momentum because you're gonna need some momentum when you go this way. Okay, so a little bit right first, and then you're gonna go left. And uh, if you want practice holding the inward lunar and keeping it on there, right to left, right to left, because this is the, the motion you're gonna need, okay? So, when you go right, and then you go left, you're gonna lift the Tama until it is completely horizontal until the ken is completely horizontal and this is all gonna happen in one motion so when you lift it up and it's horizontal you're gonna flick it this way like an inward lunar just like it's just like doing an inward lunar flip in 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 a horizontal in the air I mean you know just like that and it'll spin like an inward lunar flip so again you're gonna go right left and then this is all one motion so let me show you one time me doing it and then you're gonna flick it in the air so I feel like if you don't put enough emphasis on the Ken being horizontal you're gonna get something that looks like let me see if I can replicate it no I couldn't replicate it but sometimes it tends to tray and cork if you don't make sure it's straight so make sure that when you do this it's straight and then flick it but remember it's also one motion you can't just stay there or else it'll just fall so again and then you're gonna flick it okay so make sure you emphasize it's horizontal once you see that your flips are pretty horizontal you can start concentrating on the catch so the catch it's after two turns i decided not to do a single flip tutorial because this trick is already hard anyway and i feel like for the single flips it's harder to catch because you don't give yourself enough time for everything to happen they're definitely possible, but I feel like it's less flashy and it's, for me, it's harder to do because it happens so quickly you can't even catch it. So make sure it's a big motion. You do the double turn and when you see, track the can in the air and when you see that the cup is like this, it's about to get here, you're going to bend your knees and move the Tama towards your left like this to cushion it. All one motion also. You're gonna grab it and you're gonna move it to your left a little and and cushion with your knees and this, what this is gonna do is it's gonna make it go back into an inward lunar position by moving it to the left and the knees are going to stop the the ken and cradle it in the tom so a lot of knees for this trick practice 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 this trick and another thing a rumor about this trick is you cannot do this trick if you haven't learned the UFO version of it. Like you haven't learned how to go from UFO to Inward Lunar. That's a lie. You know why? 
because I just learned this trick two days ago and I have never ever done the, U the UFO version to it and my friend Cam Herrero I was talking to him about it the other day at Kandamanite he has never done the these ones either he just did the, the lunar ones so that's just a complete lie you can learn these without learning the UF the regular UFO ones so you don't need to l learn any of these UFO combos you just need to do this one and since this is like the trending trick of 2017 slash 2016 because it was also popular last year uh yeah you gotta go do it and tag me on instagram if you lace this because this is a cool trick okay so make sure you watch the slow-mo i'm gonna make sure i did it two times one one time was a little sloppy and the other time i don't know if i'm gonna show both of the times maybe just the cleaner version and i'm gonna make sure i slow it down a lot so you can see all the momentum that goes into it all the motion so yeah, if you land this, tag me on Instagram. I want to see. Okay, see you guys.